If you're interested in becoming an audiologist, then you have come to the right place. What's up you guys, it's the BA. Welcome to the channel where we cover all things related to careers and academics. Today we're going to be talking about audiology, and more specifically, how you can become an audiologist here in South Africa. Firstly, what is an audiologist? Audiologists specialize in communication science and disorders. Typically, these professionals work with patients who have problems with hearing, balance, or other ear-related problems. Audiologists measure hearing loss and determine its cause. Once a diagnosis has been reached, they develop a treatment plan that takes into account the impact that the disability is having on the patient. Audiologists are often members of a team of health professionals that includes speech pathologists, physical therapists, occupational therapists, and physicians. What does an audiologist do? They test babies, children, and adults for hearing loss or other hearing problems, operate specialized audiometric equipment, interpret test results, diagnose and evaluate problems, fit, test, and supply hearing aids and cochlear implants, keep up to date with technology and research, study disorders affecting hearing and balance, produce an impression of the ear for an ear mold, increase hearing ability by using lip reading or other communication skills, manage patients with dual sensory loss or learning disabilities, manage staff, and keep detailed patient records. What are the requirements to become an audiologist? Audiology training programs are delivered through a number of accredited universities in South Africa, and these are typically associated with programs in speech language pathology. The programs are usually housed within the faculties of health sciences or located within the education department of the respective institutions. Audiology programs in South Africa are delivered in the format of a four-year undergraduate course. Historically, audiology courses were offered alongside speech-language pathology and graduates were duly trained and able to qualify as both audiologists and speech-language therapists. After 1998, many university programs started to separate the programs into single profession tracks, leading to qualifications as either an audiologist or a speech-language therapist. The entry requirements for audiology training in South Africa typically involve matriculation endorsement, that is, a final high school pass rate that is the minimum entry level for studying a bachelor's degree at a university. With completed subjects like maths or maths lit, English, and physical or life sciences. As I always say, if you want specific requirements, it's best to look into the university that you're interested in. Clinical training of audiologists typically starts early in the degree program at about second year and increase over the course of the program. Students are required to obtain 400 hours of clinical work, which is carefully planned and monitored to ensure that they are able to register with the Health Professions Council of South Africa at the end of their final year of study. Clinical hours are recorded for assessment, intervention, observation, and case discussions. Of the 400 clinical hours, 375 must come from clinical contact and 25 from observations. Students are exposed to a variety of clinical audiology functions throughout their four-year training, including community clinics, hospital clinics, university clinics, simulation clinics, schools for the deaf, and institutions like DEFSA. Several universities offer postgraduate qualifications in audiology via a research-based master's or PhD program. Once students have graduated from an audiology program, they are required by law to complete one year of paid community service before practicing in the field. Community service is mandatory for all healthcare professionals and the program is run and managed by the Department of Health, who is responsible for applications and placements throughout the country. There are quite a number of health professions that exist in general, so click here to find out how you can become a nurse in South Africa, or click here to find out how much physiotherapists make here in South Africa. That's it you guys, thanks for watching, do check out my other videos, and as always, mischief managed.